ఫ్రెండ్స్ ఓపెన్ మేక్ యూమెన్ సాఫ్ట్వేర్ మూ టు జామెట్రీస్ అండ్ చూస్ ఎ డ్రెస్ ఫార్ ఫీమేల్ దెన్ మూ టు పోజ్ ఆర్ అనిమేట్ అండ్ చెక్ ద ఆప్షన్ డిఫాల్ట్ నౌ లెట్స్ మేక్ దిస్ మోడల్ స్టాండ్ స్ట్రైట్ చూస్ పోజ్ అండ్ సెర్చ్ ఫర్ ఎ స్టాండింగ్ పొజిషన్ దిస్ పోజ్ లుక్స్ ఫైన్ నౌ చేంజ్ టు మోడలింగ్ చేంజ్ ద హైట్ వెయిట్ ఏజ్ అండ్ మసిల్ ప్రాపర్టీస్ టు మేక్ ఇట్ లుక్ లైక్ అ ఫీమేల్ సో ఫ్రెండ్స్ ఇట్స్ టైమ్ టు సేవ్ దిస్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ మూ టు ఫైల్స్ ఎక్స్పోర్ట్ అండ్ చెక్ ద ఆప్షన్ డాట్ డిఐ అండ్ క్లిక్ దిస్ త్రీ డాట్స్ టు ఎక్స్పోర్ట్ దిస్ ఫైల్ నేమ్ ఇట్ యాస్ డ్రెస్ డాట్ డిఏఈ సేవ్ దిస్ ఫైల్ అండ్ వన్ మోర్ స్టెప్ ఇస్ పెండింగ్ వీ నీడ్ టు సేవ్ దిస్ మోడల్ వితౌట్ అ కాస్ట్యూమ్ సో మూ టు జామెట్రీస్ అండ్ అన్చెక్ ద కాస్ట్యూమ్ నౌ ఎక్స్పోర్ట్ ఇట్ యాస్ డాట్ ఓబిజే సేవ్ యాస్ బాడీ డాట్ ఓబిజే దీస్ ఆర్ ద టూ ఫైల్స్ విచ్ వీ సేవ్డ్ నౌ డ్రెస్ డాట్ డిఏఈ అండ్ బాడీ డాట్ ఓబిజే ఇయర్ ఆర్ ద సేవ్డ్ ఫైల్స్ నౌ లెట్స్ మూవ్ ఆన్ టు బ్లెండర్ చేంజ్ యూట్యూబ్ వీడియో క్వాలిటీ టు వన్ ఎయిటీ హెచ్డి విల్ వాచింగ్ బ్లెండర్ టు అవాయిడ్ బ్లడ్ డివిషన్ క్రియేట్ ఎ న్యూ ప్రాజెక్ట్ సెలెక్ట్ ఆల్ అండ్ డెలిట్ దెమ్ ప్రెస్ కంట్రోల్ ఎస్ టు సేవ్ దిస్ ఫైల్ క్లిక్ ఆన్ ఫైల్స్ ఇంపోర్ట్ డాట్ ఓబిజే లెట్స్ ఇంపోర్ట్ బాడీ డాట్ ఓబిజే ఫైల్ Let's import the other file. Click on Files, Import .dae. Now select Dress .dae. You can find .dae object is smaller than .obj. First, let's concentrate on the costume. Select the bone, that is select Pose under Dress. After selecting it, change it to Pose mode. we can't find any changes in this because the bones are redundant let's make it visible in the front of the object move to modify properties and check in front option selecting the thigh bone and rotating it to make it stand straight also do it in the opposite leg yeah that's fine by following the same method we can edit the pose of this 3d model friends here comes an important option bones you can find it on the right corner it makes our job more easier you can select a bone and rotate it along x y and z axis also scaling options available edit and pose also change fingers position to make it look more natural friends make sure you are in the fingers properly because there are chances for them to get damaged after printing you might have noticed some miniature images in internet have their hands damaged this is what the reason they won't give proper support or proper strength to fingers while printing often don't forget to use sculp mode after using post mode after editing this let's move to the next procedure let's add a mesh circle and i gonna use this for a reference placing it near neck and using it as a reference to draw the collar for this chudidar also use this knife to crop it back side I have increased the video speed. You can do it slowly. Now, let's select the remaining points near the neck. Click on shift and select the points. Select them all. After selecting them all, let's delete the faces. Click on delete and choose faces. Separate dress by loose spots 
and delete the unwanted part. Also hiding the circle. And it's time to complete this to the move to edit mode. Select all the points at the bottom. Use wireframes to select the hidden points. Now click E and extrude till the leg and separate it. Change to sculpt mode and smoothen the extruded parts. Let's delete the head of this model and use the head of the other model. Add mesh cube. Select the new model. Move to modifier properties. Add modifier and choose boolean. Now select the cube and press apply. Let's make this new model look smooth. Move to sculpt mode and make it fit to the dress. Let's add face to the chudida. Select all the hanging parts and choose F to add face. Also we need to add face to the neck. Select all the hanging parts near the neck collar. I have increased the speed of this video. You can do it patiently. Click on E to extrude and yes to decrease the size near the collar. After doing this, extrude and add face. Let's check whether everything is done. Yeah, it's look okay. Let's crop the size of the leg. Do the same what we did earlier. They are slightly ejected outside. Sometimes it may happen. Move to sculpt mode and push them inside. Everything is going fine. And final touch is to draw a shawl. Use pen at the left side and draw a shawl as a rough work. Click on add mesh and select plane. Rotate the plane 90 degree along the x axis. Now let's make the plane trace the rough sketch. Click on E to extrude or to rotate and S to resize sometimes. I have increased the speed of this video. Actually it took more than one hour to record this content. Till now we have traced the path along y axis. Let's trace it along the x axis. Take your time to make it look much better. Because once you made it, you can use it n number of times. I have used all my time and made it look much better. Also kept the download link in description. You can download and use it. Since I was recording this video, I wasn't able to make it look more perfect. I have already made a Chudida 3D model and it looks more better than this. I will display it at the end of this tutorial. I have no idea how other people make 3D models. If you are a YouTuber, you can post your link in the comment. Actually this editing takes more time. And you know, I have no content to speak, really. Make the shawl in such a way that it fits to the neck. And leave some space between the neck and the shawl. Later you can solidify it. And use sculpt mode to make it look more better. Make the shawl long in front, comparing back side. Okay, that's good. Let's make the same at the back side. Nearly we came to the end of this video and one final step is more. Move to modifiers and click solidify. You can select the range of thickness you need. Make sure 
the thickness of this chart is suitable for 3D printing. Now to modify S, choose subdivision surface and set levels view as 2. We need a subdivision surface to make the chart smoother and much more softer. Change to sculpt mode and edit the shawl as you need. Make sure the shawl doesn't hide inside the dress or the skin. Use elastic deform to bring it front. As I promised earlier, here is a 3D model which I have made before recording this video. I will select them all and compare it with the present model. Yeah, I have copied and pasted the old model and reducing the size. Now the size seems to be ok. Friends, I will try to record a new video and try to explain it more better. Friends, you can see how beautiful it looks.